y'all. Okay, what? So that's the new world order, y'all. Okay. Um, Michigan. A city in Michigan votes to permanently ban the pride flags from display on public property during Pride Month. And Detroit is really what they said. As communities across the United States celebrate June as Pride Month, a city near Detroit, Michigan, has voted to permanently ban the display of the pride flag on public property. Now, this city council, Ham Hamtramix, whatever, city council members voted unanimously Tuesday to approve the controversial revolution, uh, resolution, which restricts the city from flying any religious, ethnic, racial, political, or sexual orientation group flag on public grounds, according to the meeting minutes. Now, residents and businesses will not be restricted from flying their pride flags. Mm -hmm. I don't see a problem with this. I think the the, <clears throat> the, the part of it came from that the display of it on the uh, Capitol, or what building was that in the Washington? The, the Washington has a, <laughs> a, a, a gay whatever, gay pride the rainbow flag, pride the rainbow flag. Because a lot of people are saying, wait a minute, then why not put the, the flag that represents the Jewish, uh, the, the Star of David? Why not the put Christian the flag, flag, the Christian flag? Why not put the flag that, that represents Latino? <laughs> Black Lives So I never knew there was a Christian flag. I'm mm -hmm. just saying, and it is. I'm sure somebody will create one with a cross on it. Yeah. But I'm Google it. I've seen it but at the churches. The point is, mm -hmm. I get the, the, the whole pride thing and the pride month is coming up. Oh, February, you put our, our flags up, people of color. Uh, 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 the, uh, what is the Cinco de Mayo? Uh, the Cinco de Mayo. Cinco de Mayo. You put that flag up in the, in the month of May. So in all honesty, for public um uh locations no your own businesses can have them your well, homes can have them yep it says dozens of community members spoke on the resolution during several hours allotted for the public one individual who opposed the resolution says um, for you to attempt to equate the lgbtq pride flag with hate symbols when it's a symbol of progress and love is now a local attack on our community i don't see where they said hate symbol they said any religious political or anything see how people hear what they, they always hear. twist it how did you hear that resolution and then you stand at the microphone and say why are you trying to say gay people are hateful no that's not what they we're say. trying to say if we don't want a specific flag representing a specific people on public property unless everybody is right. represented now here's the problem that they have that the people have who are opposing it. Mm -hmm. This city, it says, has a large immigrant presence and the majority of them come from Muslim or Muslim faith. Thank you. So if you in a city, again, we talked about Target. Whose bright idea was it to put a transgender uh, display Section in the front in, Target. in any, uh, not any in um, Alabama? The Bible Belt. Or <laughs> place where you know it's probably one guy that's openly gay everybody else is talking about them and you decide to put that in the front of your store and all the targets in that's Alabama. a store manager in my opinion in South Carolina, Carolina. so you can get away with it new york you can get away california more pro progressive cities not in hillbilly alabama uh, south carolina so this is a city where the majority of the people in the city are muslim mm -hmm. you actually think you're gonna be able to fly a gay flag mm -hmm. At the at a, at a, a government a, building, at a government building in the city is mostly Muslim. And the thing that concerns me is that when we say no, people automatically think you're rejecting us. No, you don't want us here. You don't. No, it's almost like I know a lot of people got mad when they took prayer out of school. I know Wendy, you can speak to this too. Yeah, yeah. a lot of Christians got mad. For taking yep. prayer out of schools because we our country was built off of well, we in God we with trust. That. Some people I do get We disagree it. with it. She agrees. Well, no, no, I'm saying, oh, the, yeah. the one thing I was saying is if you do leave it in the schools, understand there's people from other religions that would want to pray too. I said, and that's unfair to say Christian prayer only when you got a Muslim kid right. there and you got another kid that's probably an atheist. Well, I agree with taking it out because I even though I know a lot of Christians disagree with me. Right. Because I don't want everybody praying over my kid. I don't know that's who you pray too. to. That's true too. I don't if, know what you, you look pray at to. it that way. You look and at some it. of these teachers, uh-uh. 
I don't know who you pray to, but I, I don't know what you're going to say. But one for all mm -hmm. and all for one. I'm thinking people need to understand the civil rights movement was for everybody to have the same playing field. And we didn't pull out only in February, put the, the, the black, the, the black people's uh, flag up on uh, what month you're going to put the Muslims up. Well, it says the resolution was not only aimed at banning the display of the pride flags, but also flags of other groups. Um, he added, um, recently, I recently met a person who had asked to raise a religious flag, mm -hmm. which would not be allowed mm -hmm. according to the resolution. That's why I told you there is a Christian flag. Right. We are not targeting one group, he said. As, the, as a result of the vote, the only additional flags that they will allow are those that represent the city's immigrant heritage. Mm. Now that I disagree with. Mm. Because just because your city is majority Muslim, why you get to fly your flag? Thank you. Mm -hmm. You should only have the go. United States flag and your city. The state flag, the city flag, possibly your town if y'all have your own little flag or township. Right. That's it. That's it. No religion. Why are we why do they no them? sexual orientations? No race. It needs to be government. So that part, I disagree with. Yeah. And then maybe that's why the gay and lesbians are having an issue with this resolution. Okay. You take our flag out, but you keeping the Muslim flag because up. Because they're not, the city is 95% Muslim. Exactly. That's not right. Now, what if I wanted you to put my flag up? I'm Christian. No, you only have 1%. So well, the Christian cities probably feel like if we're 95% Christian, our Christian flag should go up because it's majority of us. But on the same token, they could probably say, you guys say um, uh, one nation under God and all. Are you talking about the Muslim God? Or are you talking about your Christian God? <laughs> oh, my God. So this will go down the whole oh rabbit hole. God. We spend bills with y'all God and God we trust on it. Oh, yeah, that's and true. The, that's, the, what, that's why they don't care about changing the money or the currency. Does in the in the um December, do they allow them to put the, the Mary Virgin Mary in them up? Yeah. Now, if they do, that's probably why they saying we're flying our flag because in December, you guys put that dang on nativity scene up every year. Thank you. See, it's so just they got to do a, a one, one, they have to do everybody or nobody. And you do it at your own private businesses and your homes. They said you can still fly the gay flag, uh, flag at businesses and at your home. At your home. So that's fine. You can do your Muslim the, flag at your home. The only thing I disagree with is them allowing the immigrant flag right. to be up. Exactly. So they if probably do need to fight that. Uh, Muslim mm -hmm. from this place. Mm -hmm. If they all put flags in their yard, that's a bigger um, look than putting one flag up at the building. But you know a lot of Muslim countries don't even want anything Christian. They yeah. don't want you talking about it. They see a Bible. China right. is really big for but that. The and is it's unfortunate because they'll let other religions go right. free and talk. But when you say Christian, and we all know why. Well, the problem that they have is that they're not in a Muslim country. They're in America. That too. So you a little town in America. But America is built off of godly principles. Right. So, so you've got a lot of Christians who still want laws in yeah. place that is biblical yeah. and there's the movement of God yeah. in it. Yeah. So yeah, you're going to get fights on both ends. Yep. All right. Speaking oh, well. of God. Speaking of church and God. We always say we want to do a TikTok.